Overcrowding in Pasco County schools has some parents outraged. They are upset about the possibility that their kids could be moved to new schools. And today, Pasco County school officials are set to finalize changes across the county. ABC Action News reporter Adam Weiner is live this morning in Pasco County ahead of a big meeting. Adam, what are families saying about the proposed changes? Well, as you know, Dia, a, a lot of families specifically moved to this Wesley Chapel community so that their kids would be able to go here to Seven Oaks Elementary. But now those students may be forced to go elsewhere. The big reason uh, is overcrowding, as you say. Pasco County leaders say that it's simply something that has to be done because Seven Oaks Elementary now at 170 percent over capacity. Now, that's why many students who go to who, who go here to Seven Oaks Elementary might by next year be going to Denham Oaks Elementary in Lutz, which is actually under capacity. There's changes like this happening all over Pasco County. Uh, it's a, the reason a lot of parents are upset right now. Take a listen. We chose to come here a year ago and put our roots down and plan to stay. Um, and I want my kids to be interacting outside of school with the same kids they're interacting with inside of school. Now, the district says they're trying to listen to parent concerns, but also the boundary changes, they say, simply make the best financial sense and best fl planning sense for future growth. The school board's actually set to continue the finalization plans this morning, and we've actually got a whole list, a link to that whole list of Pasco County school board changes on our website, abcactionnews.com. For now, live in Pasco County, Adam Weiner, back to you.